I'm getting ready to marinate the beef steak guys so here I have two tablespoons of soy sauce I'm just gonna go ahead and pour it on the beef and yesterday guys I'm doing grilled beef steak here I have one teaspoon seasoned salt Here I have Old Bay Season, one tablespoon. Here I have a mixture of seasonings. Here I have black pepper and all purpose season guys. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pour it all over the beef. Here I have a pinch of salt. So now I'm just gonna use my hand and just turn it over and turn it over because I'm gonna, what I'm doing right now is to let the beef marinate. So I'm, I'm getting the seasoning all over the beef guys. They suck up that juice. You want that flavor in your meat, guys. You want that flavor in the meat. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and let it marinate for at least 15 minutes, guys. So today we're doing beef. And we're going to grill it. While the beef was marinating, I went ahead and cut some onions. And guys, yes, I did cut the onions. Look at the shape of the onions. Okay, so this is the way you wanna cut the onions, this thick. And let's take a look at the marinade beef. As you can see here, it's well marinated. And I'm gonna get ready now to put it on the grill. Guys, the smell is amazing. You know what time it is. If the flame is on, then it's time to put the beef on the grill. So guys, take a look. Take a look. So what we're going to do here, guys, we're going to spray it up. Just spray it up. Just like that. Let's get ready to rumble. Here you have the beef steak. So let's see if it's time to turn over the beef. Look at it guys, got a nice bone to it. I love my beef steak well done take a look at it guys the beautiful color look at it mm, 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 mm. can't wait to take a bite over this beef steak guys mm, 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 mm. so now i'm getting ready to place it in the oven I'm going to go ahead and add the onion that I cut in big chunks before I place it in the oven. 
so I just placed the onions on top of the beef steak. Let's take a look at it. Beautiful, guys. Delish, delish, delish. It's time to place it in the oven. The beef steak is in the oven and I'm gonna go ahead and set the oven to 350 and it's gonna be in the oven for at least 15 minutes guys. I love my beef steak well done. Here you have the papaya. So the beef grilled steak is in the oven. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut the papaya up to make the refreshment. But today guys, I'm not gonna use the entire papaya. I'm just gonna use a portion of it. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut it. This is what it looks like when you cut it open. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and use a spoon to take all the seeds out and then I will be peeling the papaya also. I'm just gonna scrape it all out. Now I'm getting ready to peel the papaya. So just get the knife, just like this guys, so you peel it, I'm going to get it <laughs> a bit messy. So here I have the peeled papaya, so now guys I'm going to go ahead and cut it in small pieces and I'm going to blend it to make the refreshment. So nothing fancy, you could cut it any way you like and then just place it in the bowl. So that's what I'm doing now, just cutting it in small pieces. Here you have the washed and chopped papaya. And of course guys, you know how much I love ginger. So I'm gonna add some ginger to the papaya today guys. And also, I will be adding just a little bit of sugar not a lot just the taste try not to have it too sweet today guys okay but if you guys love ginger then you won't forget to like share subscribe and comment don't forget it's an amazing thing when you like share and comment okay guys so don't forget Okay, so let's move over to the blender to start blending the refreshment for today. Just in case you're wondering where in the kitchen am I? Well, I'm at the juice section now, so it's time to blend. So here we have the ingredients. And I'm going to go ahead and pour them all together in the blender guys and what was that okay five cups of water i'm sorry about that five cups of water here here you have the papaya Just go ahead and pour the ginger in, guys. Can you see it? So now I'm going to go ahead and add the sugar. Just sugar to taste. I'm adding the sugar just for taste, guys. I don't want it too sweet. It's time to blend.
here you have the papaya just blend up so guys i'm gonna go ahead and strain and then i'm gonna go ahead and place it in the refrigerator for at least 15 to 20 minutes strain in don't forget to like share and comment lioness sim simon okay Hi everyone, so I just got done finished making the papaya refreshment, so now I'm going to go ahead and blanch the snow pads. Over here we have a pot with water, olive oil, and of course guys I add some salt to the water. So we're just gonna go ahead and blanch them. Hi everyone, welcome back to the Line Simpson Kitchen. Here in the kitchen today, I made a special, special menu for you guys. Here we have grilled steak with snow pad and for refreshment it's papaya stay tuned and we'll be right back welcome back to Linus Simsima it's time to taste the delicious delicious meal okay here you have the grilled steak I love my steak well done so I'm just gonna go ahead and dip it in the sauce and I'm gonna take a big bite guys a big bite mm. it tastes really good really really good mm. Guys, that grilled beef steak, it's the best I ever had. So it's time to taste the refreshment. The flavor is amazing. The flavor is amazing. The color reminds me of my tropical island the sunset it's beautiful there just like papaya refreshment don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to Lioness Simsima channel she will be back